Hello dear friend. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, and another video about Squarespace, today's video, I will explain to you how to custom text background and hover effect in Squarespace. First tutorial, I'm going to teach you, how to change a text block background color. We'll use CSS change to color, create a gradient color, and you'll learn how to upload your own image to use for the background of a text block. Text blocks can have a solid color background, and thanks to CSS, we can customize it. And don't forget to install Find Squarespace ID in Google Chrome extension, to find the block ID. You can find the CSS code on description below. So, check this out. Ok, let's start this video. This video can be used for various versions of Squarespace. We have to find the block ID, by using the extension find ID Squarespace. And we can change, solid background color. Background gradient. And background image like this. Here we have three text blocks, which we will modify with different versions. We have to go to the design section. Then click custom CSS. Don't forget, we have to install the find Squarespace ID extension on Google Chrome. We click. It will appear on each block text. First, click block ID copy and paste on custom CSS. Enter the CSS code to change the background color. Then, the background color will change. You can change the color by color code or mention the color directly. Next, we will change the background block text with a gradient color. Click block ID copy and paste on custom CSS. Enter the CSS code to change the background to a gradient color. Then, the background color will change to a gradient color. You can change the color, and the color percentage as you wish. Lastly, we will change the background on the block text to an image. Click block ID copy and paste on custom CSS. Enter the CSS code to change the background to an image. In the URL, we will include the image file. Click on manage custom files. Add image files. Change the URL by clicking on the image file that was already input. The background image has appeared, but it's not perfect. We can increase the background size to contain, or hover. Adjust the size of the text block. This is the result of changing the background of the text block, with the color, gradient, and image. In the second tutorial, you'll learn how to create your own hover effects for Squarespace. I am using version 7.1 in this tutorial, we will change it with the help of the CSS hover code. But the code concept works for older versions too and it will change background color, border radius, opacity, and grayscale filters. 
Here we will add hover on text, image, and button. Let's go back to custom CSS. Like before, click block ID then copy ID and paste it into custom CSS. Add hover text, next to block ID. Enter the CSS code to change the background color. Adjust the color you want. Then you can add border radius on hover. Enter the CSS code to change the radius. Customize as you wish. Then, we will add hover on the image. Copy paste block ID. Add opacity style to change to transparent. Input scale. Don't forget to add hover text next to block ID. Add a grayscale filter to the hover image. Then hover opacity and grayscale will appear in the image. To apply the same hover effect, to all block images. So we can add this class. Then all the block images will have the same hover. Next we can add hover on the button. Copy paste class to change block button. Enter the background color style. Add hover text. Adjust color. Then add a border radius. Adjust radius. Then the button will show hover to change the background color and border radius. This is the result of making hover on text image and button. By changing the background, opacity, border radius, and the grayscale filter. Ok my friend, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to get more information about blogger. See you on next video.